Good morning, Vintage Beauty. So it is Friday morning. I am about to run a couple errands. First, I'm gonna go to Marshalls and Ross just to see what beauty products they have. Then I have to go to the doctor with my husband. I have to pick up some antibiotics because I literally have had this infection, cold, whatever, for going on three weeks. And so the doctor put in an antibiotic prescription for me. Um, I will show you my outfit of the day once I get in front of a mirror at Ross or Marshalls. But these are my Aldo glasses that I have and my uh, Soul Sister earrings. Um, yeah, so stay tuned for this mini vlog. We will be going to run a few errands and I'll try to get my husband and the camera because he be acting like he's too good for my little vlogs. Anyway, stay tuned. Marshalls first and they had the nerve to okay this card is no good they had the nerve to not be open so Ross is about to see these coins first okay with these all broke down cards So Ross is going to get these coins first. So I am in the more home section and I'm gonna see what they got because I do, I'm getting a new office and I wanna decorate it. So I see some cute little candles that I may pick up. So stay tuned, I'll show you where I'm at. Look at these cosmetic organizers. This one is $10 and I kinda like it to put my jewelry in but my space is not that big however this one is really classic looking to put rings inside and hang some bracelets i like that one i actually like this one too but it doesn't have a price on it and i hate when that happens because you didn't don't know i may get this one even though i like this one it says let your light shine it's three dollars more than this one this one just feels like the space I don't know, I'm gonna put this one in. I'll put both of them in just because I'm not sure yet. But some of this stuff, if I see something for my office, I'll get out. I see something already. Look at this. Queen Mom, $4. I like this. Cause my office is gonna be pink and gold. I think pink and gold is so classy. So that's gonna be mine. Oh, wife, the maker of the room is always right. I like these mugs are four dollars. Oh, because Mother's Day is coming up not too soon. I'm gonna also get some stuff from the thrift store, but my office is gonna be pink and gold. So this is just some of the home stuff they have. Let's go to their makeup section. Just want to show you my outfit of the day. Something simple to work out in. Let me go this way since she want to come over here and be in my video. Just like that. I like when people see you filming and they still want to Yep, something simple and cute. So even when I get here, I even start at their vitamins. So here goes some adult gummies, some fish oil, some biotin. Um, let's see, immune support, which I need since I've been getting sick. So this is a good one, but I want an actual multivitamin. I prefer a, I don't mess too much with um, face stuff that I don't know nothing about because my skin is sensitive and so I don't mess with stuff like that but they have a lot of vitamins here I do need a new setter I mean a, um, 
what you call it when you're setting your makeup y'all know what i'm talking about but this is some of the skincare stuff if i see one i'm getting it <clears throat> so here goes the mac primer right no okay let's see the bath bombs i kind of don't mess with just because that's like really saturating your skin i'm very very skeptical on stuff that i get i don't get too much cheap cheap stuff it has to be something i recognize only because um this is more nail stuff now this is good but it's only for men cetaphil is really good um let's see what they have over here yes this is where I really want to be on this side. Let's see if they have the Pro Fusion. Elf, to me, they're, um, what do you call it? Oh, is this a, oh, this island? Elf's, um, eyeshadows, to me, are not pigmented enough. And so, I kind of don't like them. Oh, you know what? I got this the wrong way the whole time. Jeez Louise. So, it's going to be a little crooked. Let's see. Look at this nude palette. Mm -mm. It don't look like it's going to be no good. I'm not going to even waste my time. These are more brushes. When I go to Marshall's, I'm going to see what they have. This is what I'm hoping to find. Some good. So this is their shadows, and they have a lot of nudes. Oh, look, they have these NYX turned up for six dollars. But I'm good. I'm good. Like I don't just get stuff just because. And if I make it an eye shadow palette, it has to be something a little bright. Because I have nudes and stuff. Like, I always kind of keep it. So, let's see. I'm going to look and then we'll see. Next, I am where the tights are. I like seeing cute tights they have. Oh, those are my tights, y'all. These are stockings. I'm not talking about stockings. Literally talking about tights. Which I don't see any. It's certain things you just get from certain places that you don't thrift, right? Mm -hmm. I thrift um, scarves, so I wouldn't buy them here. So I'm not interested in these. But I do want to see these other beauty products. Because my office will be pink and gold. So I'm going to see what I do. I like anything over here. I would like this mirror on my desk, honestly. I don't like this. It's only $9. This would be cute for my little setup at home. Scarf hanger. It's cute. Let's see what I can find at the thrift store, though. It's just cute. Because my office is going to be pink and gold. I can wait on that, you know what I'm saying? I like this. I got a jewelry box coming from my grandfather. Here are they little clutch bags. You know what? If they have a cute enough fanny pack, I just may do it. 
I really want to thrift one. It's more fun. But let's see. This is kind of cute. This little Betsy Johnson. Betsy Johnson makes really cute aesthetics. We'll see if they have a fanny pack. Look at this. This is interesting. Aesthetically, it's ugly. <laughs> okay. So, Vintage Beauties, I just finished Ross, and I I think I did too much in there. I spent $50. Um, but I got, like, some great stuff that I'm going to show you guys. I think I'm going to just go to TJ Maxx and not even go to Marshalls because I still got to go thrift shopping, and then we have to go to the doctor and all that good stuff. So, I will go inside of TJ Maxx, see what they got up in there, popping and ropping and ropping, and then we will be back. Okay. When you just walk into TJ Maxx, you can see the difference automatically from a store like Ross. Just look. Like, if I really wanted to go ham up in here, I could. I wish I kind of would have came here first. But my tip is you always go where they sell cheaper stuff. And you always check clearance first because just because it's on clearance doesn't mean that it's not good. They just put it on clearance for whatever reason. So let's go over here. I have a small clearance. Let's see. Mm. Peppermint oil. Three dollars is worth getting. Forgot a basket. Let's see what's in Bath and Body. Essential oils. Oh, look at this. Eight dollars for an essential oil kit. Okay, I'm just look at this peppermint oil because it's on sale. Let's see what other, other, let's see what other kind of moving kind of fast this is where I want to be and they have profusion like I like all this profusion right here I love I like profusion so I'm gonna see if they have the contour one that I liked You see all of this? Such a big difference in comparison to Ross. We'll see. Oh, it says with or without food. Oh, good. So me and my love muffin are at Kaiser. <laughs> I told y'all I was going to try to get in there. This is my best friend. I love him. Stop, I love babe. You too, babe. Stop. Don't do that. Why you always got privacy? My rights. Like Don't a, be quiet. Like, <laughs> I can get. I think you got to privacy. I got rights. What rights? <laughs> Your rights are my rights. Your rights are my rights. I'm gonna you. For what? You gonna take? We already won. Stop. He always doing something. Stop. You got five seconds. Four. <laughs> so we are at Rio Coastal Bar and Kitchen at the Delamo Mall and we are about to have lunch. It is an outside eating area and look at this you guys. They brought me a blanket because I'm cold and we are like at the worst table. But this is so nice. Hey stop. So I'm going to order I just ordered a cucumber coconut water. <laughs> And my husband ordered the watermelon spritz. Be quiet. So we are going to get our food and then we'll show you. We like teasing our kids when we go to places and they're not here there with their auntie. So yeah. So we will show you our food when it comes. Okay. You got anything to say, babe? Seriously? <laughs> Here are our two drinks. He actually has a slice of watermelon and I actually have a slice of cucumber. I have the cucumber mint one and he has the watermelon spritzer. What you got? Is it good, babe? 
delicious. You just said it's all right. It's all this other George stuff. Is all right. You always want to act funny. You don't even say delicious. Why the heck you say delicious? <laughs> It don't even sure. make no dang sense. You don't even say delicious. Why would sure. you say delicious all of a sudden? <laughs> <laughs> That's a, oh. He doesn't even use the word delicious, so why would he even say that? Like, that doesn't even make sense. You know what? I guess I see the benefit of not having the camera where you can see yourself because human nature, you look at yourself. Whereas if you didn't have that, you would just look directly at the camera but because you see yourself you look at yourself like i'm trying not to look at myself but i keep looking at myself and here's the blanket that they gave me he always trying to that blanket has dog hair on it it does not have dog hair okay, on it no stop what look look at your finger your finger oh, is I'm on gonna, it i'm gonna fix all that that's dog hair that's not human hair whatever who don't love a dog <laughs> Our German Shepherd is shedding like crazy right now. What? She's shedding like crazy, and so you can literally just pull. It's shedding season. It happens all the time to German Shepherds, and um, what's those other ones called? Co not Collies. Um, you do know with the blue eyes and they great. Well, stay tuned. We're going to wait till our food comes out and we will be back. Me and the bag. Look at him So I ordered shrimp and grits. Look how good this looks. It looks all southern. And my husband ordered grilled cheese fries and then he got a side of grits, which they're going to bring up. This grilled cheese looks so fancy. Fries are pretty good. They're a little crispy though. And here comes his side of grits. Thank you. No, that's all. Thank you. Mm, this grits look good. Can you get back? Okay. <laughs> you guys, these grits are so bomb. I think they got a little cheddar in them. So flavorful. I have a piece of shrimp. How you like it, babe? Delicious. If you don't stop saying delicious. <laughs> I don't want to do it, man. Turn it back. Uh, he always trying to ruin something, y'all. He don't ever want to take part in this journey with me. Subscribe to my YouTube channel. Tell him, babe. You got anything? You was talking. I thought you were going to say something. <coughs> say something like what? I said, tell him, babe. How are you post video? <laughs> oh my God, you guys taste it. Taste it. It's so good. Mm. Mm. It is so. My kids would love this. We're going to tease them, you guys, okay? Mm. And the ambiance is so beautiful. This is so, oh my God, this what? is so, the ambiance. A-M-B-I-A-N-C-E. -E. <laughs> That's right. Oh, yes, it is. A-M <laughs> ambiance. Oh, who cares? I know what it means. It's the setting. I spell better when I write. Ambiance. Um, whatever. How's your grilled cheese? Don't say delicious. Don't do that. Let me taste it. It's a piece. Hold it. This is grilled cheese. It's fancy. It would have been good with this uh, soup. Mm -hmm. For you. It came with a side of tomato bisque soup. Okay. It came with a side of tomato bisque soup, but he opted for fries. The soup and this type of bread and the cheese would be good dipping inside. But this shrimp and grits, y'all. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. mm. It's 
such a southern meal and they did that they did this mm. so long I'm eating and not sharing with you guys well I'll see you later. We may get dessert. I don't know. Look at his eye peeking, y'all. Y'all see his eye? He always trying to peek. <laughs> we may get dessert. I don't know. This is a pretty chill place. Not too expensive. Like, my shrimp and grits was only $13.50. He always trying to order sides and stuff. But, yeah. Okay, it's just... Oh, well, that's why you're supposed to have water in your mouth and then drink it. Mm. So now we are at Little Company of Mary's Thrift Shop in Torrance. So they have a rack that's $1. So let's look. This is just this rack right here. So I found something already on this rack. I've never been here, so I want to try it for the first time. I'm going to turn you guys around so you can try it with me for the first time. Oh, I kind of like this little sweater. Eh, nope, it has a moth hole. So let's see what I can find. Let's go inside of the thrift store. I walk in and the first thing I see are these red guest heels. Eight and a half, they're so cute. My shoes, five dollars, not bad. Let's see if we have something that I would want. I really see. They have it organized. So plus size dresses over there. And here goes some purses. Sometimes it's cute to go to small stores. Here go their little accessories. Not accessories, but sometimes it's cute to go to small places because it's easier to find. Maybe I'll find a fanny pack, guys. Okay, stay tuned. Hey Vintage Beauty, so now we are at the conclusion of my mini vlog. I thought I would just end it here at home showing you exactly what it is that I picked up. Um, we will start, so I went to three different stores. Um, I went to Ross, TJ Maxx, and then I went to Little Company of Mary's Thrift Store, which is in Torrance. So let's just start with Ross. I got some things that I usually don't get, like seriously, because I'll be decorating my office um, soon, and so I saw just one thing actually. Some of the stuff that I showed that I saw in the video that I showed you while I was at Ross, I didn't even get those two things, the um, the organizers for like my little space. I didn't get it. Um, so let's just start <laughs> with Ross. I got this big bag of now and later's. They were $4.99. They are so good. So they are the original mix. They're called now and laters. He okay, tried to say, he now tried to later. say they're called now laters, but they are called now and. You see that yellow A N D? While my husband over there talking, but didn't want to be in the video. They're now and laters for five dollars. I also got this multi-pack Omega-3 Deluxe Mix. Oh, let me turn it this way. These were $4 and it comes with a pack of seven. So that's a good deal. Is it? What? These suckers was originally $5. So I saved a dollar. I'm not happy about that. If I would have saved $3, I'd be more happy. But still, literally $5. Okay, so I bought two pack of those. I already ate one and it was pretty good. Wow, originally $5. Like I'm so sad now. So this is the Cranberry Hearty Health, Heart Health. Wait, Healthy Mix. Then I'm gonna show you my makeup last. I got this little wireless light show Bluetooth. And this would be cute in my office for when I want to listen to my Pandora or listen to my girl Rock. Um, yeah, listen to some Lecrae. Listen to some um, Contemporary Christian. Just listen to all my jams. 
yeah so this is a, a little bluetooth speaker that i will be putting in my office um then i got me some tea i'm starting to like tea more and more and this is highly's pure japonia's matcha oh i'm sorry this bluetooth was seven dollars and this tea was four dollars so it's matcha tea matcha is very very good and it has um turmeric in it so turmeric is very good as well so this is japanese tea no gmo colors or preservatives so that was four dollars if pepper don't move um i only got one thing from tj maxx then i got this really cute mug it says queen mom and it is that light pastel pink and gold that's going to be the color of my office pink i'm going to decorate it pink and gold so i'm going to really get me some accessories um later so this cup was four dollars for this mug it says queen mom i really really love it this is like for a really big cup of tea So this is for a really big cup of tea and cup of tea. So that was $4. Now let me go to my makeup palettes that I got. Um, that I got from Roth and then I got one from TJ Maxx. And then I'll show you the stuff I got from this one thrift store. And then we'll conclude the video there. <laughs> so like I told you, I love Pro. Oh, I also got my son these jeans. They were only $7, and they're really, like, I like the texture. I like the little detail, like it has two little buttons here. This will look so nice with a regular white tee and his little all-white Jordans, or he got some all-white guest shoes, or he got some white Jordans with a little bit of blue. I mean, he got a lot of shoes. He can wear this with, he has a lot of shoes to choose from with this, but I like these, and these were on sale $6.99 originally. They were, I don't know. I can't get the tag off. The Ross price, I don't know, before. But they were on clearance. And these are just, uh, why me? Whatever, I don't know. Um, I just like the texture. Like, I like the different, um, I like the, the design of the jean and the variation that you get in one jean. So it's really classic looking. Not classic, but it's really, like, trendy. So these are super cool. So these are super cool for my son. So I got these from Ross for him. So that is that part. And then I have Profusion. I got me two new eye palettes because I really don't have any. I only have one really good one and that's my, I have these other ones, but my really good one is my, um, my uh, Too Faced palette. But I like Profusion. I don't know why, but I like them. And I found these two at Ross and this is their Profusion Mixed Metals 9 Matte and Metallic Eyeshadows. These are super, super I'm trying to get the, look at this pretty mirror too though. Oh you can see my stuff over there. You see my stuff? Ah you see the camera y'all? <laughs> but here goes the colors. I don't know how good that's coming across. Let me take off this little film on top so pretty you guys oh my god so pretty like this was so i'm not gonna put that back on with this big old mirror like i can literally sit this down and do my eyes because it sits up just like this so this was only seven dollars and worth it to me we'll let's see how pigmented it is because that's one of the things like how how good does it pick up? So let's see. I'm going to do the gold shimmer. Mm, let me see. That's okay, right? Let's see. Now let's do this platinum one. That picks up fine. I think I'll be okay. Let's do this one. Oh, that one picked up really good. So we'll see. With some primer... I think I'll be okay. Then I got this um, Profusion Shimmer Glam Eyeshadow Collection. And this one I got because I like these colors. Like, honestly, I got this one because of these colors right here. I like these two colors. I love that blue. 
I even like that purple a little. So I don't have anything like this. So it comes with a little eyeliner, which I won't use, and that little eyeshadow brush, which I won't use, and then also another mirror. So that's the other thing I love about the Pro Fusion. They're not expensive, and you get, they all come with these nice little mirrors and cute boxes. Like, look at this box, super cute. So this one was only $5. <coughs> <clears throat> then I went to TJ Maxx. I forgot to get some um, setting primer. So I'm going to have to find some. I got another Pro Fusion palette. But this is the Smoky Eye. And it comes with 10 eyeshadows. Oh, this one doesn't have a mirror. But still, these colors are beautiful. So I just take this off and show you the colors oops that i got i probably can use this little brush i'm not sure but these colors are pretty nice um once again i like these colors down here but this would be really cute for the smoky eye which i don't know how to do so yeah we'll have fun with these guys <laughs> okay my husband said he know how to do it so we're gonna do a my husband does my makeup so that's it for TJ Maxx and Ross. Like I said, I only got one thing from um, TJ Maxx. I need to go back out and get some primer though. So let me, <laughs> this thrift store, I spent about $24. It was so worth it. So worth it. So first I got these red pants. I know I have some like this. These are were four dollars, but my other ones are actually too big. These are size six, so they're probably too small. But they are not; they're um, vintage, so they're probably like from the eighties. So we'll see. But these nice; these are in actually really good condition, and it still has the pockets. So I figured I might as well get me another pair because my other ones are too big, and I don't plan on fitting them. Like, I'm not going to go backwards, right? Then I got this. So I can see this working. Look at this. I don't know what it's supposed to be. It's, it's not a dress, Mommy, because it doesn't close right here. But wearing this with some, like, I could even wear this with those red pants. Because it only closes at the top. It buttons at the top. Then and then it just opens and it has the slits on the side you shirt. guys it's I wish I could yes I know can you be quiet I wish once I tried this on this was six dollars but it was so worth it like it has the slits it don't button all the way it only buttons at the top and then it's open at the um, bottom part I would wear those red pants with that and rock it and kill it but look at this, y'all. Actually, let me show you my accessories. Accessories, not accessories. Look at this belt. This is a for real vintage belt. What in the world? Here we go. Look at this vintage. Okay, you know what? Okay, here we go. Look at this vintage belt. It's like a black suede material. But look at the gold clasp. The lady sold it to me for $4. Look at the hardware in the back. This is so vintage, you guys. This is how you adjust the belt. So right now, it has to be adjusted all the way. But we're going to see. We're going to get that down now. But look at this. Look at this clasp. It reminds me of something Egyptian. So can you imagine this with that? Like, this is one whole outfit. I could wear that sole together. Like, I can wear that outfit together. Those red pants, that top, and this belt. This is so Egyptian. Like, um, it is so beautiful. So, it just clasps just like this. So vintage. $4 for this. It was originally $6.99. But she was like, you know what? Since you're buying all this stuff, $4. And this is a tiny, like, tiny thrift store. So, $4 worth every penny even if she would have charged me seven dollars i still would have got it because it's worth it mm -mm. but she gave it to me for four so i'm happy so this is four dollars love this belt i would wear it let me show you, you can go to the TJ Maxx I already went there and Toys R Us to get a new 
See? This is how this clasp. Mm. So cute, you guys. <sighs> this was my, oh, uh, you know how when you go to, all my thrifters know, when you go to the thrift store and you get that one piece that make you like, oh that was this like i feel like the heavens open i was paying just signed it and god said my child look up look up no no you're not done look up and i said yes father and he said right there yes to the right to the right now dip baby dip and right there it was right there you guys <laughs> so i also picked up a couple of watches i don't wear watches because they work because even when i have on my watches that are brand spanking new I wear them for fashion. Like they are accessories to me. They're not to tell time I pull out my, someone can ask me for the time and they see my watch and I know they'd be like, why she just won't look at her watch? Cause I don't tell time that way. Duh, who does? <laughs> so this is a Benris and I looked it up. This is like a 1960s watch. Benris um, quartz, Japan, um, Oh, Japan movement. So this is a Japanese watch from like the 60s. But look at the detail. It has this, hopefully it focus. It has this little rose detail on it. Give it time to focus, right? Oh, that's all it's going to give you? Okay, there we go. And it's genuine leather. And it says genuine Australian leather from Japan anyway so I got this this was five dollars with 25% off who cares I hate math um, <coughs> this was seven dollars so I have this is also one of those Japan movement watches a Jenny B quartz watch um, this is also vintage, but what I like about this is I have a, a like a bracelet and it's a nurse's one. So all of the charms are like nurses are related to being a nurse. These charms are related to being a hairdresser, but look how vintage it looks, you guys. It's so beautiful. Isn't it pretty, mommy? Uh -huh. So this was $7 with 25% off. Okay, let's try to do this math. So half is three fit. I nope. I'm done. I'm done. I'm sorry. My that head start hurting. Her headaches. It does. I'm done. I'm so done. Don't even ask me. Then finally, this little baggie of earrings. Each one you see it was one dollar. But look at these vintage earrings. They had some really nice one, you guys. But they were clip on. I can't do clip on. It hurts and it like pulls. I can't do clip on. But all these vintage earrings, $1 each. All of these are vintage. Like, you know they're vintage. That's why they look like that. My daughter said that's why they look like that. This may not so much be vintage, but it was a dollar. I don't even know if I really like it, but <laughs> it was a dollar. <clears throat> these are so cute. I can see my grandmother liking these. I'm going to see if she likes those. I like these, they're different. So it's not necessarily like, oh my God, these are hot. These are hot, like oh, off the rack. No, they're just different. I like these, these are cute and vintage. So all these earrings, oh, what, she got more? I, I literally took all of them. Look at these, this is so cute. And I like how they put it on a little paper. So these are, oh, and I love these. Cute little earrings. They have some really hot earrings. Those, those are mine. You want these, Jay? Yeah. Jaden's claiming these. You don't like these? No. You want these? Yeah. Okay, so these goes to Jaden. Yay! She just made her claim. So, that's it for that. Stay tuned. Um, after I post this, I may really take some time and try to edit it, a.k.a. my husband. Huh, babe? Babe. Babe. Carlton. <laughs> he doesn't want to pay attention. <clears throat> so I'm going to really try to get this video together. Or do your makeup. Um, and then at the end, your daddy could do your makeup before mm -mm. you say. So 
I think that's about it. I feel like I had a really good day. I'm so happy you guys went with us today, spent some time with me and my hubby. I still owe my son a lunch date because I had one with my daughter. I always have one with my son, my husband, and my son was gone. So it's just gonna have to be me and my son one day. Um, we went that time when he went to the high school, but we didn't go out to eat. We didn't do anything else. We went to work out. We didn't go out to eat that day, huh, dude? But you guys had a mother Sunday when you went to work out and stuff. Yeah, but me, you went to dinner. Me and you went to lunch, and then yeah, me and your dad. Yeah, it's not me, you. It's you and me. <laughs> grammar, people. You got to learn your grammar. Stay in school. Wow. <laughs> On that note. <laughs> Wow. <laughs> Looks like she told me, guys. And then she back there making these serious faces. Anyway, so, like, I'm so embarrassed. Because <laughs> I'm a college graduate, you know what I'm saying? And my daughter is only in the fourth grade. And she corrected my grammar. And then she called me out and said, math make my hair hurt. I didn't even tell all y'all that, though. You but did. I don't remember saying that, though. Yeah. And then she pat me on the head like that little sad puppy pat. Like, it's okay. All right. <laughs> I got you, Jay. <laughs> so, this is Jaden, though. This is how she is, boy. We call her little corrector because she be, um, actually, actually. I don't sound like that. <laughs> yeah, I no, I actually, don't. that's not how it goes. You're supposed to say this. It's all good. I want my daughter to be super smart and my son. Girl, move. <laughs> so, anyway, it's your girl, Vintage Sister. Do I love crazy? In the comments, we <laughs> Girl, move. How's she in the comments below on my video? Um, move, Jaden. I, I am. Move. I had enough. See? Never fails. But guess who didn't pop up in the video, though? P E P P E R. I got to spell it because she heard her name. By she the coming. way, Pepper. <laughs> Jade, okay, I'm going to get mad in a minute, so it's time for me to get off this screen, because I'm going to start fussing. Y'all want to see that. <laughs>